I decided I might make a little video on my transistor tester. Because I have not made a video of this yet. I've had this transistor tester for a long time. I've had this for several years. A number of years. I've had it for a long time. But, um... It was a nice transistor tester I got from my friend a long time ago, and it's works, it works nicely. It's by Elenco Precision. It's a model DT100. And we'll demonstrate operation testing some transistors here. Oh, yeah. And diodes. So... There's a number of components that can be tested here. Let's test a germanium diode. The diode lead onto one side, say the cathode. And one of the transistor leads, well, I always use the emitter lead because it's right next to the diode lead. And to the other side of the diode. And now, let's see what it says. Is it just a diode? Cathode, because the diode lead is put onto the cathode, so it shows a good diode. Let's try this beast of a diode right here. And I have the diode lead hooked up to the anode, it should blink anode. Good diode. Now what if a diode isn't quite good? Here's a diode that is mostly good, but is not quite good. Take note that the cathode one lights up just dimly. So there's a little bit of reverse voltage being allowed through. It is not a good diode. Now let's test the transistor. Say you have a transistor and you can't get any information on it and for crying out loud it doesn't even have any number or anything. It just says what the emitter base collector are. Well, line it up with the emitter base and collector on the socket here. And set this to transistor. Can now say you're trying to measure it and have it set to PNP and you're wondering if it's okay. When the okay light does that, that means it's, it's just, it's not, you know, it does that when there's nothing on there. Oh, you're turning your base current up, but nothing goes on. Keep testing. And you find it, they, it goes to NP when it's down low. Okay. Switch it to NPN, and now go. Now control, put up the base current. And you see it's okay. Up the base current more, NP lights up more. At a certain point, base current will cut off. I mean, the, I mean the okay will cut off when your base current's at a certain high point. So you take it down just a little bit. And it shows it's a good NPN transistor. This is also a good way to figure out the pin configuration of a transistor because on this tester 
you can test for NPN and PNP and try out different configuration to the emitter base and collector until you find the one that's right and if you hook it up wrong on here it does not seem to mess up the transistor now let's test an NPN I mean a PNP transistor such as this one 2N 3638 that little notch there marks for the emitter so I'm going to put it in like this. And shows a good PNP transistor. So that's just a quick little video of my Elenco Precision um, DT100 transistor diode tester. A good device to have along with test equipment, including a multimeter such as this one.